down. This, we are going to put. Come, 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 come. How can someone look at? Show them. Look at. How can someone have all these clothes? For what? Hey, we start with this. Look at this one. Here. This is Mombasa. Rongo is coming. Look. How can someone have one million clothes that they're not putting on? Hey, chai. Salam. See, is it not madness? <laughs> this is madness. How can I have a, a, a own room for just clothes when some people don't have clothes? Madam, come shop, come shop, come shop. Take them out of out, out all. Hey. No, 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 no. This habit must stop. This thing happens when I could not even, I could not put on my one cloth for two days. When I put on my one cloth, my clothes for two days, nails, hey, we are tired. We are tired of that cloth. Okay, now see, see what, see what social media pushed me into. See what social media pushed me into before I learned who they were. Until I learned them nails that they don't even have clothes to change. Then you just buy your, your clothes. Even some still have tags. Look, I look like a mutumba seller. See, I'm just... Show them. Show, see what social media can make you uh, as a person. See, I've just cleaned. This just part one. Then we are coming to part two. This is church clothes. Save us. Church clothes. God. God is living here in my house. Then this one. This I don't know I can call them Malaya clothes or whatever clothes they want to be. This social media, I just buy my expensive clothes. I put it on one time. I cannot repeat because they will tell me, hey, you are you are only repeating that clothes how many times? <laughs> Mrs. Nyas, see what before I learned what social media is, see what they pushed me into. Some clothes I've ever put on just once and then it is done. Some are even stolen by the the the, 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 the houses and the the houseboys and everything. See ya. This is this is just Mombasa. Rongo is another set. I am offloading everything. And I will be putting on one cloth for five, five times in a month. If you come and tell me that I've repeated that cloth, I will insult you, you, your mother, your father, your church pastor. And I want you to tag me your wardrobe before you tell me that I've put on clothes two times. See what you people have done for me. See, all this is money. This, all this is money that I've wasted. Because of social media. Because if I put on my clothes, I bought expensive for two two times, maybe two times a month. And then, yeah, yeah, that clothes, yeah, you put them. See, this one. These shoes, they don't even know. It's even torn. See, go and call the police in your in your, in your area. They tell them I'm just putting on a torn shoes. These shoes I, I bought it in Switzerland since three years ago. They don't even know if it, if I have two or one. Then they can hey, hey, hey. see what you put me into. See, you pushed me, you pushed me, you pushed me until you pushed me until I'm now owning a clothes shop in my home. I have to, to prepare a wardrobe and have all this kind. See, see, social media, see, see, you made my house into rubbish. You made my house into rubbish with your comments. This is how you push us celebrities into wasting money for nothing. Now I even have, look, see, see him. I didn't know even, look, I didn't even know this one was here. Now I keep on shopping for you. Who are you, idiot? Who are you? Who are you to tell me what to put on and who oh, have broken my neck? Who are you to tell me when to dress and when not to? What to put on two times and if I find you on my wall again? Wait, I must breathe. Yes, if I found you on my wall again, telling me how I should dress, and if I should not repeat the dress two times, are you shopping for me? Are you shopping for me? I am asking you, idiot! You will make celebrities commit suicide. Hey, that dress, you put it on two times. Hey, that handbag. That and see. Bring them, let them come and see. See. See by yourself. You think I'm joking? See what madness you are driven me into. See, this is another. Uh, this is this is supposed to be Papo, Papoyo's room. Papoyo left. Now this is another clothes for one person. See shoes. I cannot even put on my boots in peace. These boots I bought for one thousand five hundred dollars. Now if I put it on two times, they tell me, hey, hey, you put on that that shoes. Two, three, four times. We are tired. You and who? You and who is tired over my dress code? What I'm dressing and what I'm not. Idiot! Go and call police. Tell them I'm seeing. 
Russell. Three shoes. This one. I only have two pairs of legs. And you want me to have different kind of shoes every week, every day, every day. Madam, show me your life. Show me your life before you start dictating how I live my life. Idiot! <laughs> my people, not be smart, yo. Nothing when Musa no go see for ghetto. Nothing when we no go see for this social media when we do. When I know say this social media, the power when it gets not be small. Social media is so powerful, my people. Who say social media no no they powerful? That person don't know what thing they do. When I know say this social media feed turn some people brain to the extent they no go the reason where again. When I know say this social media go feed turn people to the extent. All their life, they will come use and take pay loan because of social media, because they want to meet up, because they want to slave. Even people when no say they're not capable. Some people now go there, they go, they spend more than their income. Before month go end, they go don't spend money more than what they are expecting. At the end, when they will come pay, then they go use and pay, but say finish, they no will come get reserve. You can't see that that time their eye go come they red, they can't get pepper body. Not be you because problem for their self, for their body, oh. Not be you send the social media slave queen and still. Not be you because they are problem before, oh. Because of the, they know they, they live extravagant life. They want to be like others. They want to blend. They want to meet up at all costs. Some married women now, so you, now you make you go come see some married women now. They're not they they satisfied with their husband anymore. They're not they they satisfied with the one when their husband they provide. You see our Nollywood actress and uh, actress now because the men they not they're not come out they send like that. But our Nollywood actress is the same thing they are the same fake life they are living. The same social media lifestyle. Social media have pushed a lot of our celebrity into madness now. Some of them are money when they they hold now not be here. I remember one lady, one of the uh, one of the Nigeria celebrity Nollywood actress that time. She can't come at one Bini lady. I don't forget her name now. When she can't talk, one lady when they hold her. You the whole person, you never feel pay the money. You they fly, you they fly first class. When you the whole person, one point something million. You call the flight first class. And the person when he give you the money, borrow, she they fly economy. Person when he give you that money borrow, she they fly economy if she want travel. But you when you borrow money, one point something when you never pay, you want travel, you go want travel, you go they fly first class. When I see why be say when person go they talk most of these things now they say I beg mama leave that thing, leave that thing. My dear sisters in the house, this social media don't repair many many people, and at the same time, this social media don't destroy many marriages. It don't destroy many ladies. It don't destroy, it don't send many people to early grave. It don't push many ladies to things that they've never dreamed they would do it in their entire life. Social media is so powerful. That is why it's just like what the Bible said. He said the power of life and death lies in your tongue. It's, it's almost similar to the same thing as social media. If you are not in control of yourself, if you are not in control of your life, Social media will mess you up in a way that you will find yourself in a deep mess. A lot of people out there, now, especially some, some ladies, mostly these youth, now, these, uh, uh, these single ladies now, that is why you see they, so they love going after married men. Instead of them looking for their old uh, young man to start life with, they would they say that one you never blend. That one where they wear one trouser, you go, because you want to slave, because you want to show off. You want to wear new shoe? Some people don't wear clothes twice. Some people don't wear shoe twice. Anyone they wear, they will not wear it again. Imagine who be you now? Who be you? Clothes when you go like a person like me now, there are some clothes that are very expensive. When I get, then I'll come wear only once because of social media. Then I'll come go to wear. So girls, then now when be say I buy very expensive in Spanish shop now. Because many people not laugh, many people not say I not be slave mama. I not go repeat the cloth again. Why? Why won't I repeat the cloth again? Now see what that Kenyan lady, that uh, Kenyan celebrity, she is like she's a musician too. Now see what she they talk. Everything we talk for that video it makes a lot of points, a lot, a lot, a lot of points. 
That is exactly what they happen for this uh, social media era at one day. So, so women they now then go tell you say they cannot wear cloth two times. Why can't you wear cloth two times? Because you cannot repeat one dress twice. You end up borrowing from a friend, from a friend to a sister, from a sister to a friend, friend. You end up living a life, a fake life, a miserable life. And when you are addicted to such lifestyle, it will be so difficult for you to change, to change your ways. So my people, I beg you in the name of God Almighty, please don't let social media take over your life. Imagine some women now, because of social media now, their husband can't even talk to them anymore. They don't listen to their husbands anymore. They don't listen to the decision of the family. So don't even have time for their kids anymore. So don't even cook at home. There are some ladies, some married women now, they don't cook. They don't cook. They don't cook anymore. They spend all their days on social media. Those that are busy commenting are busy commenting. Those that are busy checking what, my, what this one is putting on today. There are a lot of people on social media in deep, for different missions. A lot of people on social media for different missions and different reasons. Eh? Imagine married woman now where you're supposed to they think I go to raise the family. How they go to build family when they go, they go feel move to the next level. They go, they busy. They busy, they look who wear the best clothes today. Who, who, who is with one long pass? How many inches the person wear? Now this social media, you can say people go talk about person matter, talk about person matter, carry person matter problem. They not go remember to think of their own. And now here you go, constantly see some women. Go stick on, they laugh their fellow women, say no only one dress that they wear. And you, when they laugh, person say no only one dress that they wear. All the ones when you they showcase for this uh, Facebook, Instagram, you uh, uh, truth, anywhere one a day. If they check her now, they go your house now, they say, my sister, that dress when you wear that, they are like her. Let me see, let me see the cloth again, I would like to order. You know, go fix her bring. Because the cloth not be your own. Because you want blend at all cost. You two go go borrow person you, you can't wear. Many ladies they now. To the extent some lady they borrow a earring to take on slave for Facebook. So go come borrow shoe to come slave for Facebook. My brothers and sisters, especially my ladies in the house. I have said this before. I thank God I stumbled on this video today. And I'm still using this same video to advise you all. Please, my lady, sew your coat according to your size. Don't be pushed by anybody. Don't go beyond your expectation. Now, what thing I say, make I still can't tell now. Now, bye bye, me, now take care.